Hey guys, this is a quick and easy guide to make your live stream completely smooth. My system specs as of recording this video are as per the following. CPU Ryzen 5 2600, GPU RTX 2070, RAM 16 gigs. Although this guide could very easily work with anything equal to a 4 core 8 thread CPU and any GPU that has an NVENC encoder, the lowest end GPU with an NVENC encoder is the 1660. Another quick thing to note, is that I stream at 720p 60fps on Twitch. Although for the very short time I streamed on Mixer, I streamed at 1080p 60fps. This worked perfectly fine also. So I would think this rule applies for 1080p 60fps Twitch streams. Step one, open Streamlabs as an administrator. This gives the application priority over applications that you may have open. This allows your CPU to dedicate its resources to encoding your stream first rather than the resources going to your game first. Don't worry, in my testing this has very little impact in gaming performance. To do this, you will need to right click the Streamlabs icon, then run as administrator. Then a message box will pop up, just push allow. You'll need to do this every single time you want to open Streamlabs. This is what I have done so I don't need to do this every single time. Go to Properties, Compatibility tab, Change Settings for All Users, then tick the Run This Program as Administrator box, then finally click Apply. You'll still need to push Allow each time you open Streamlabs, but this will make sure it always runs as an administrator. Step two, enable performance mode. This is a very quick tip which I found benefited me the most. Enabling performance mode simply disables the preview window, which I usually find it as a distraction anyway. When I didn't have performance mode enabled, my gameplay was capped at 60 FPS and my stream would often drop five plus percent of my frames. To enable performance mode is easy. Right click anywhere on your canvas and click enable performance mode. To read any new followers, subs, tips, etc., I use the mini feed section built in the Streamlabs. Step 3 Use the NVENC encoder. It used to be the case that the 264 encoding was the better option for better looking and higher quality streams. This is no longer the case, and both encoders are more or less equal to each other. The NVENC encoder is a certain part of your GPU that is dedicated to encoding, which takes away the heavy lifting of your CPU and onto the dedicated part of your GPU. I recommend anyone that has a GTX 1660 or better from the video to use this as in my experience it has very little impact on FPS although your mileage might vary. To enable this on Streamlabs go to settings, output, then find the encoder options and select MVENC new. Another quick tip is that I recommend to use as little animated sources as possible that stay on the screen for a long time, such as webcam borders, etc. as they surprisingly can eat up a lot of your CPU usage. This may not be a problem for most people, but just something to note down if you use a low-end CPU, such as a 4-core CPU, such as the i5s or the Ryzen 3s. Anyway guys, that will be the end of the videos, please like, subscribe and share and also please check my Twitch, the link will be down below in the description. Thanks for watching and if you have any questions regarding this video or you need any advice just leave a comment and I'll reply to you and try to help you as best as I can. Alright guys, thank you for watching, goodbye.